Hello, this is H.C. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man Battle Network! Last time, our house caught on fire. Let's get out of here. What the? Shouldn't we have the key to the door, though? Hmm, maybe it's electric or something, and they hacked it. Uh, couldn't we just, I don't know, leave out the patio door, or call the fire department? Or anything remotely useful other than walk, running around like a chicken with its head cut off? But whatever shall we do? What toolbox? Well, I'll just tell you. It's right over here. And what do we get? A water gun. Your house is on fire and you're going to use a water gun to put it out. What, do you got like four ounces of water in there? I don't think that's going to be very effective, but I suppose we don't have a choice. Hey, hey, all right. Well, that was easy. I would think water wouldn't be effective on an oven fire, though. I mean, aren't there, like, certain kinds of fires that water isn't very good for? Like, a gas fire, or a grease fire, or... Well, I guess this would be, like, an electrical fire, but... Yeah, I would think water wouldn't be the best way to go, but... I'm not a fire safety expert, I don't know. I'm an engineer, not a fireman. But anyway, yeah, let's, uh, get moving and continue exploring the oven network. Yeah, I misspoke in the previous episode where I was saying how this is connected to the internet. I meant it was connected to the house network. That's why the phony repair guy had to physically get to our house to hack into our system instead of, you know, planting it across the internet or something. But anyway, I want to put that new sword chip to use, another steel chip, and let's put the spreader chip to use too. That ought to be pretty good. Let's continue onward, then. Okay, and after that battle, I got a, another Metguard 8 chip. Awesome. I want to get 30 of those eventually, but yeah, that'll take forever. I'm going to save that for much later in the game. But anyway, yeah, we got that Ice Block program. Use it on one of the flames. Boom, they're gone. But remember, if you run out and you got to go back to the program to get more of them, the flames will respawn, so you want to watch out for that. Shouldn't be a problem, though. The area's not that big. Now, we could go down this way, or the lower left there, but I'm gonna go take the long way around because we can get some treasure here. Another shotgun chip, awesome. I like the shotgun chips better than the crossgun chips, even though crossgun hits more tiles. It's not very likely that enemies are gonna just line up for you like that, whereas a shotgun, more likely the enemies will be one right in front of the other. But anyway, let's continue on up this way. And on this path, we get more money. All right. I would question the logic of putting money into your oven, but then again, that would make it pretty hard for a burglar to get to. So, okay, that works. And let's see. Ooh, pretty good chip there. Little bomb. Nice thing about this one is that it's basically the same thing as a mini bomb, but it also hits the tile above and below your target, which can be pretty useful against enemies who move around real fast and try to avoid being on the same row as you, which normally would make it very difficult to hit them. So, let's go over here then. Get rid of that. Game. Thank you. Okay, how's it going? Well, we can take care of him. How hard could he possibly be? Uh, dude? You okay? Oh, okay. Okay, got another random battle there, one step away. And we got another shockwave chip. Awesome. Let's see, get rid of that. That ought to be pretty good. I think we're all set and ready to go. Hey, nice helmet there, dude. But I'm afraid I'm going to have to take you out. Mega Man to you, buddy. I heard WWW is pronounced World 3. I don't think I've ever seen that in the game. Maybe it's something from future games. I don't know. But, okay, I suppose that works. I always kind of wondered what that abbreviation was for. We can take you. Sure, we can't use the ice block chips. We don't have ice man power like the first game, but that's okay. What, you're going to declare war on my house? How does it even work? 
Wh why do you care about burning people's houses down? But whatever, we can take them. I don't need any select pause glitch to beat you. Mega Magic Flame! For boss time against Fireman. Okay, let's see. What do we got? What do we got? Hmm, I'm going to go with my shotgun chips here. Now, the way Fireman moves is he moves or teleports to three random tiles. And on the third one, he'll sit there for a little bit. And then he'll teleport a fourth time and actually attack you. So you want to hit him on his third teleport there. So just try and keep that in mind. Okay, one, two, three, hit him. One, two, three, hit him. One, two, three, gotcha. Okay, let's see. Now I could use my wide sword chip. Maybe if he stays there. Yeah, we can go with that. Are you still gonna attack or no? Okay, hit him. Hit him. Okay, one more. Uh, let's see, a good dash chip? Hmm. I can one-shot him with that, but I'm afraid I'm gonna miss him because he's pretty fast. I'll go with it, though. Let's give it a try. Oh, nope. Didn't anticipate his move that easily. Oh, well, we got him anyway. Hooray! Woohoo! Eh, thousand Zenny. Awesome. Ha uh ha. -huh. Sucks to be you, huh? What do you mean? What mission? What plan? Oh. Why would anything special be in my oven? I don't know that if they ever explain that. I mean, I can guess based on having played the game before and I know the plot, but I don't think they ever say they did this because of that. Why would they want to kill everyone? Then you'd have no one to worship you as a god. Doesn't exactly sound like the best plan. Oh, you're welcome. Is the door unlocked now? Probably. Nah, I wouldn't worry about it. The guy was probably just talking out of his ass. Yeah, don't worry about it. You're just a kid. You have no responsibilities. Well, they weren't exactly controlling the internet. They were just controlling our house. Yeah, I wouldn't worry about it. Sure. Well, yeah, we just kind of worked pretty hard to... Oh, <laughs> Nice little pun there. Spelling pun. Uh, only in text would that joke work. That's... Oh, well. Oh! Okay, sure! Now, in order to progress with the plot, you could go to your room and go to sleep. But let's not do that. Let's go around, because, well, now that the day's over... Well, some people have gotten home from school, like mail. Alright. Well, let's check out her house, see what, what she's got. Hmm, nice place you got here. Oh, okay. But as we all know, like every good JRPG, someone tells you not to do something, you then therefore have to go do it. And she has a piano that we can hook into. I don't know why you would need that on your home network, but okay, whatever works for you. But anyway, yeah, this is a relatively small area. But they have some treasure that we need to get. And a couple new enemies. Okay, now these guys, what they like to do is they'll just keep on teleporting around forever. And eventually they'll turn into like a weight or something. I don't know what you call the things. And they'll drop down and crack the tile there. So I want to wait for them to do that before hitting them with my shockwaves. So let's just do this. Wait for it. Come on. Are you going to attack me? Thank you. 
Oh! Wow, that was easy. Uh, I meant to do that. Carry on. Oh, we got a pretty nice chip there. Quake 1. 90 damage, but it is really, really slow. So I wouldn't put too many of them in your folder, but if I could get two or three from them, that would be really nice. Because there are some enemies, like the cannons, or bosses oftentimes, they don't move around very much, or they're just so big that they really can't move. So yeah, Quake 1 chips are pretty nice. Or, well, Quake chips in general. But anyway, let's see, what do we got? What do we got? Oh, we're gonna need that chip for later. But at least we got it for our collection now. And okay, we got Mail's homepage access. So what we would have to do to open it up is we'd have to go back to Internet Area 1 and unlock it from the Internet, not from here. But I'm not going to do that right now. We're done in the piano here. Let's head on upstairs. See what we got. Let's see, right over here. Okay, sure. Let's, uh... Jack into Males Toys. Let's see, not too much special around here. There is one treasure I want to get. Does it say, hey, listen? Oh, or that. That works too. And what do we get? An HP memory chip. I wouldn't buy HP memory chips because I don't think HP is ever really a problem. But, I might do some later. And by the way, the enemy that I got that Quake 1 chip, I think their name is Flappy. But like I said, they don't give enemies names in the first game for some reason, but I heard that's like in future games or something. Okay, but we're all done here, so uh, let's get out of here. But what other stuff can we find around the neighborhood anyway? Find out next time on Let's Play Mega Man Battle Network. This is H.C. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day.